What would you do with an extra thumb? Extra body parts can extend and augment human capabilities. But while augmentative technology is progressing rapidly, we're still lacking answers to some fundamental questions. Can the human brain support an extra body part? And how can using augmentative technology affect our bodies? In our study, we aim to answer such questions using the third thumb as an augmentation model. The third thumb is a flexible 3D printed thumb extension for your hand, wirelessly controlled by your big toes. Two pressure sensors create proportional control over two degrees of freedom. And it's surprisingly intuitive. With a few minutes of practice, people can quickly learn to grasp various objects. We trained our participants to use the thumb over five days using a combination of tasks that were fun and engaging whilst teaching the basics of using the thumb. We also encouraged them to take it home and use it as they liked. With time, people got better at using the thumb. Practice makes perfect. But we also found that people could operate it with a blindfold and multitask. When asked, participants reported experiencing a greater sense of embodiment, that the thumb felt like part of their own body. But how does all this impact the way your brain controls and understands your own body? Using hand kinematics, we found that people were changing the way they naturally use their fingers together with the thumb. This is important because it sends a very strong signal to the brain that something is different. To see what happens in the brain, we used fMRI, asking participants to move their fingers in the scanner. This is where we observed shrinkage of the natural hand representation following training. The neural representation of individual fingers had become more alike. And this was happening without people using the thumb whilst in the scanner, so their own natural body representation had now changed. Our study shows that people can quickly learn to control an augmentation device without overthinking, whilst also reporting that it feels natural to them, like another body part. But we also found that people changed their natural hand movements, which may impact how the brain represents their hands. Therefore, successful human-robot integration may have consequences for how the brain supports the body, so it's important to continue to study how augmentative technology can integrate with our brains.